Hey, 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 everybody. Welcome to Tuesday. <gasps> what was that? <coughs> and I'm just going to give you a heads up. I forgot my glasses. So, this could be fun. This could be lots of fun. And I went to go grab some paper and I did not. So, I'm going to try and just use what I have. But I would love for y'all to say hello if you join me. Um, I'm going to show you this cute little flip floppy thing. And I think I'm just going to use the dog's little thing that I have journal thing. Because it's here. So, there we go. There we go. So let me know you, if what you're doing this morning. And I have something to show you. I'm going to pop it down. Let me see if I can pull the picture up too. Mm. So that we can have it oh let's see can we go back to the photo library or not but anyway i finished the cute little um seriously does that go all the way back to the recents it does it backwards which is so not fun sorry guys you get to watch me do this hello 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 oh my word it's not even there Okay, well, we're just gonna forget that, and I'll just show you the real thing. Cancel. Sorry, there I am. Hey, Marsha. <gasps> Look, I finished it. I put my little BBM on the door. It's not great, but it works. When, I'm gonna think I'm gonna put it on a wreath. Isn't it cute? Yes, I'm gonna point it down so y'all can see it and go a little bit closer. Isn't that just adorbs? Now, if I had to do it again, I probably would have him standing on the actual door, on the actual car. Hey, Marsha. Um, did I miss you? Something's going on. Maybe it's going a little crazy. Am I, am I, anyway. Uh, I would, um, so I'm going to somehow attach it to a wreath. I think he is super cute. Maybe that's girl. I don't know who they all are, but I just thought, for Dollar Tree, I think it's kind of fun. You know, these little guys are so cute. And then you can go in and add some paint to them. And I think it totally, let's compare it to the other. Um, see the difference? It just knocked off the neonness of it. Anyway, isn't that cute? Good morning. Didn't that turn out it's cute? So I painted the tires. I, did, I, I zhuzhed up these a little better. And this is what we did last night. And... I just added um, my my VBM for my Vintage Bandits Mercantile. Yeah, cute. Okay, so I'm not sleeping, but I do have a I have an appointment with a doctor next month. It's just gonna take a while to get in there, and I left my readers at home, so I am like a little a little hard to see today. But I was watching Shinooki Art, who you know I love and adore. And this looks a little crooked. There we go. Is that better? There we go. And she did the cutest little flip floppy thing on um, YouTube. And I wanted to try it. Yes, thank you for that reminder, Lee. We are having 25% off all IOD products through Friday. So if you want to grab something, please do. Hang on. I'm going to point this down. Let y'all admire my little, and I'm gonna go grab some scraps, and I think that's what I'll use for this thing. Let's do that. I'm coming, I promise, I'm sorry. Her up. I think she's so cute. Isn't that cute? Yeah, she did a really cute video of this flip floppy bookie thing. It's an insert, and I thought, well, I'm gonna use some. Of, I'm, I've got some of my scraps. I'm gonna use all kinds of scraps. We'll look through those, and then just little bits and pieces. Don't ever throw those away because you can use them. And then here is the dog one. That I cut out so look how cute I feel like they are this is the size 
they might be able to take in there. So I'm not sure what we're gonna do. And also I have these fun things that I ordered and they're a little brassy, but I was wondering how, this one I, I messed up, I was wondering how it would look with a little bit of um, dark and decrepit on it. Anybody else with me on that? Anywho, I thought maybe we could add a little dark and decrepit on this and see what it looks like. I, I, oh, there we go. I was like, where the heck is it? I know I have wipes here. <gasps> okay. So, to start with that, with that box, I just want to see if this will kind of knock it off. We're going to do one. And see how it is and see if it kind of ages it good I don't know, let's see they right, just come out in buckets these cute little wipes so I don't like I've got to decide what wipes I like best you know Ooh. so we'll let it dry you can already tell it's kind of aged. Isn't that fun? Let's see what happens. Let's let dry. We may add some more. I'm just cleaning my brush with a wipe because I don't have anything with me. All right. But you can add those on a journal, like even on this little flippy thing. You could paint it up. We could use, we could go in and use the, the blue wax or something. Or, you know, you could use some of the these fun colors if you want to do that we'll, we'll see what we can play with but it would be fun to put on a corner of something if you just wanted to do a pop of something whatever so let's let this dry right here i i was working on a flip floppy thing and i was scoring it um very very heavily and um i ripped it in half so yeah let's get me up here so we can i can chat with you there we go Let's hope I can see. I sent a text to my husband. I was like, if you come to town, would you go into the bathroom in the tall gray dresser and give me a pair of glasses out the top, please? <laughs> anyway, because I wasn't going to not meet with y'all today. All right, so this is what it looks like. You have a square like this. Okay, and we're going to cut out one of them. Okay, doesn't matter which one. But it, you want it to be like this, because this goes to the back, this goes like, so you have this flip floppy thing, and then you have this pocket and a pocket here. Okay, I think. We'll see. We could always make it our own as well. So, I just, you wanna make it a square. This, I just got eight and a half, I got eight and a half by 11 cardstock. You can do it two, so if you have two sided, you can totally do that. Um, if you have, and I just didn't want to, you can put, you can put two together, you can glue them together, which is fine. I just was trying to make it as easy as possible for myself today. So this is like a shimmer blue, which would be really cute for, you know, like Easter, spring. You keep these because these are your pockets. She made, she, or you can just use a six by six, um, a six by six. You, what's a six by six pad that's which would be really fun and it's done for you and you just have to score it I scored it because I just like it better anyway so this is the way it goes like this now and then you can go in and trim things whatever you want to do but you're gonna put pockets she used some vellum go watch her because she's so good at it you know she's so good so good if it doesn't line up that is a-okay it doesn't really matter this I need to this I have a little point on this and I guess I don't know what I've done and it was slicing the paper. So we're just gonna use it like a, so it's, this is the base of it. So when you use it, you open this up and then you open this up. And I think she, when you do this, the, she did 
rectangle pockets and did this way. So when you do this, you have, oh, okay. You have a pocket here and then you open this up and you can have a little pocket. So there we go. Yes. And then you can decorate it however you want to. So let's make pockets. She just cut them. She used her cutting board, which you know is my favorite. And let's just cut a couple of pockets with our scraps. So we have one. Um, and she just lined up her corners like this. And can y'all see what I'm doing? Let me pull it down into the light. You just line it up and I can't see so I'm kind of guesstimating here folks I'm just trying to line it up and then you get two little kind of similar pockets and let's do this one and then and you just line it up on the blade I just tell you I think one of the things I miss most about okay where's this and then I just want to cut one and a little half sheet one. Oh, glasses are here. Hang on. Flooding it heavy, y'all. I can see. Woo! Yay! What a good hubby. Okay. So this one is, let's, let's just fold it in half so we can see what it is and it'll be easier. We are just going to, I'm just gonna pinch that right there and then line that up on the blade. And then there we go. Okay. He's so cute, he goes, I thought you might need him. You have no idea, babe, no idea. All right, so we have our flip floppy thing. We're gonna just, we're gonna decorate the front. All right, let's do, let's do this one and we'll use these as pockets, maybe this blue and we'll do this something else. Also have a black one, which is fun. Okay, now I can actually see what I'm doing and I'm just going to straighten this up. So you can do as much to it or as little as you want. You could round the corners, you could do, you know, all kinds of stuff. Just gonna try and, was it Chinook? Yes, yes, yes. I was, I was thinking, is it Chevy Dabby Doo Dah? I don't know. Anyway, does anybody have any questions? If you're there, please say hello. Because if you don't say hello, I don't know you're not, I don't know you're here because Facebook doesn't tell me that. All right, so this is the base of our little, she used some vellum to do this. I don't have any vellum. So I can use this blue. This could be a pocket right there. I have vellum, I just can't sew it. And I guess she doesn't glue vellum, so I don't know. But anyway, that's okay. We're going to add this right here. I'm gonna try and just straighten this out. This is just a prototype. I will probably put this in my, in my um, prototype booklet. So you can do that. You're gonna do this. We're gonna need another one. Let's do this cream one here. We're just gonna do this cream one right here. Across from it, let's see if it fits. Let's just glue this one down first and see. Any questions? Guys, are you with me? Is this boring you to tears? Am I even here? Because nobody is saying anything. There's no, there's one heart, that's it. So if I'm gone, somebody needs to say, text me and say, yo Beth. Yeah, we're just gonna do this. You can sew if you want to. You can um, glue. I think I'm going to bring my sewing machine to the shop just because I'm doing the Maker's Studio. The Maker's, you know, the open studio for Maker's and it starts today. We'll see if anybody comes. I don't know, I'm not, I'm not counting on it, but I'm gonna be, I usually make on Tuesdays anyway. Hi, Cheryl. Thank you for saying hello. Thank you so much. Thank you. How are you? So I just am gluing this on there with my favorite glue. This is not going to look like it fits together, but let's just... Hello. Hello, Jimmy. Thank you for joining us. Um, 
I just it, it just it just helps when people know I'm when I know people are here because because Switcher Studio does not let you see who joins. So you can probably go in and you can make this even smaller if you wanted to. You could cut it with the cutter and it would be straight. I would probably use. Let me find my inks real fast. Oh, they're right here. Oh yay! Good, good, good. Thank you, Lord. Okay, I'm just gonna go in just so you can kind of see it. Um. So when we put it down, when we glue it down there, I just got my vintage photo just to ink this up, just so we can kind of see it against the cream because I um, keep messing up. Not having glasses completely threw me today, y'all. So I want to apologize. Oh, good, 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 good. Oh, good, Cheryl. It just came out, Marsha. I found it last night, and I, I, prob I think I watched it like at 2 in the morning. I'm not sleeping day or night. I can't sleep, so y'all just pray for me. I'm hoping that when I do a new sleep study, I want that inspire thing. I just don't like the, I don't like the, um, the CPAPs. They just are not my, they, we don't, we're not friendly at all. They burp and fart. So you can, oh good, you can kind of see that. Okay. Then we're going to put this one up here like that. This is how she did it. So I'm just going to do what she does. It's, it's amazing what re Oh my gosh, what are you doing over there? It's amazing what readers will do to help a girl out. You know, I think it's my um, socket thing. Anyway. There we go. So we have that. And we're gonna fold it and I'm gonna show you the pockets. And then we'll, we're gonna decorate it as well. Okay. Look at that, I'll clean my, I'm gonna bring my good one from home. Okay, so look how cute that is. Okay, there's the front. Isn't it cute? I think so too, Cheryl, and I love this. Alrighty. So, yes, there you go. Oh, we could do the blue. There's that. And then you have this pocket, pocket. And you flip over it, you have this pocket, and you lift it up, and then you can have this pocket. So, you can, uh, since I cut this one, we're just going to go ahead. I'm going to punch a little tab in it so we can, I think she did, her, I think she cut, she found the middle. That would be so smart to do this, but no. Thank you, Marsha, for watching at work. I won't tell anybody. <laughs> I love it. Just listen. Just listen to my shenanigans. Yes, guys, if you're interested in IOD, I'm, I've got 25% off through this. This is probably going to need some washi or something because I've, it's almost cut. So, we'll see. I'll show you real fast. I can show you how to do the base. so glad this is what it is um, let me do a little quick let's glue this pocket and then I'll do a little refresher Cheryl so and you go to the source it was Shanuki art on um, YouTube she is the queen I adore her and you know I have this I, I crush on all these lovely people and I think maybe someday I'll, I'm gonna spread this out like that I'll show you right now Cheryl how we did it I should have cut it. This is a little big, so, oh well. I know, it's different, isn't it? It was just cute, and so she used a six by six pad, and Carmen, I didn't know what, what could, I thought, what can I send my friend who is so precious to me? And, um, you know, I thought, well, I'll send her that. Okay, so here's the little booklet, one, pocket so let's just put our little puppies right here this is a pocket this is a pocket you do this this is a pocket and then you open it up and then this is a pocket and you can cram it full of ephemera how cute are they I know 
She is good, isn't she? I know. She's awesome. I just want, oh, she needs to have an event, and I will, we'll go wherever she is. I don't know where she is, but I go. We could travel. I think she's in New Zealand or Australia. That'd be a, that we could do, we could take our little retreat on the road. How fun would that be? Uh, but I only want to travel if I can get those, that first class thing where you can sleep. And I can never afford that, so <laughs> I sound bougie. I'm not really. I'm not bougie. I just hate traveling. But isn't that cute? Okay, so this is how we put it together. This is a black one. I went ahead and I scored it carefully. I got a different score thing. And let's just, this looks like it's, we'll trim it. So we want to cut this. Just cut one of the squares out because you use it for the pockets. Okay. And then we can trim everything up if we need to. So there it is. This goes this way, this goes this way. So it's basically a backwards chunky fat L. Yep, that's what it is. And I think this is off. I didn't trim it very good, but I can trim it. For some reason, my eight and a half by eight and a half was not eight and a half on both of them. So, and Shabby Dabby Doodah, she doesn't use cutters because she says they're dangerous. I love a good cutter. So there you go, boom. Now, what are you gonna do? So we have this, let's take out all our little puppies. We have all our little aminals in here. And um, I will need to, oh, there we go. Aren't these cute? Of course, I know, it is simple, but you think it, you, I mean, I had to go back and watch it again right now because I, I, last time I thought, oh, that's so easy at three o'clock in the morning. Look how cute they are. My issue is nobody ever makes a Pyrenees. <gasps> Look at that puppy. Now that could have maybe been Molly. Look at that. Look at that. Aren't they sweet? I think it's just so cute. Yes, it could totally be that. Yes, you could totally make a little Valentine, just a little something for somebody. Totally. Guys, well, I've got you. I'm just, if you didn't see the thing last night, please go watch it. We made this. Isn't it cute? Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. Well, this is the back. There were three metal hearts for a buck 25. This was a buck 25. So this was this was one piece. So dollar twenty five, dollar twenty five, two fifty, and then this XOXO was a dollar twenty five. So is that is that three seventy five? I don't do math. And then these little fellers came in a packet of twelve for dollar twenty five. So about five bucks plus tax. So five times five thirty, is that right? Yes, they're printable. They're off. Of, they're off the um, digital collage club. Hang on, let me show you. You know, I'm a, mem I'm a member of that digital, that dog lover kit, the ephemera kit. It's Digital Collage Club. They give you all these big papers, these sheets, these full sheets. And, um, oh, there we go. It's Digital Collage Club. Club. And you, I got this too. Look how cute that is, which would be really cute. This is Valentine's. I used one. Look, Carmen. I made the box from your little, um, from your... You know, oh, pattern. Oh, and I cut out one of those. Isn't that kind of cute? From my printable kit. It's Digital Collage Club. You, it's like a hundred bucks, and then you get every. And then it's forever. And I think it's with um, Shabby Dabby Doo Doll because they come in A4. So, but I print them. Look how cute. Look at that. Look how cute that is. I also got the. This is the vintage Easter Dominoes. Anyway, super cute stuff. The, look how cute. Aren't they adorbs? I just wish there was something that looked a little Pyrenees. And so I printed out some, these are pages. And look how cute. Now this, I don't know if this is on photo paper. That's a difference. So yeah, anyway, doesn't matter. How cute are they? Super fly cute. Oh, and this is inspiration for, um, I want to do in my shop over the thing. I talked about that last night. 
All right, so let's say if we were gonna decorate. I punched out these little fellows because it was easy with punch. And let's find one really cute puppy to go on the front. I feel like that is so cute. And that tells you it's the beige and the um, blue kind of story that we got going on. Okay, so I'm just gonna take my hands, my fingernail, and it's, yeah, I don't know where the Digital Collage Club, I'll try to find the link for that. You can join. There's two ways to join. I, I, and then I forgot about it for about six months to a year. And then I found it. And I'm like, holy mackerel. And I'm just going in to make the sides kind of icky. Because I like it that way. But you don't have to. You don't have to do that. Okay? You don't have to. You can also use your scissors to make it scrungy a little bit. I know that um, Shannon with Shanuki Art, Shanuki, I, you know I don't know how to say that. Anyway, she kind of does this too. She, I just always love how she just beats it up a bit, the corners, you know, so it doesn't look so brand spanking new. I'm vintage, so I like, I just like things to be a little rough. So I like to beat stuff up. And so that's all. And then you're like, well, that just looks terrible. But hang on. I'm not done yet. Then you take your vintage photo ink pad and you go in there and look, I've, I need a new one. I've eaten that up pretty bad. <laughs> good, good, hi, Pat, how are you, honey? How are you doing? How's the dust settling? I'm so sorry. Y'all, our friend Pat, she lost her mom a couple of weeks ago, so yeah, so sad. Anyway, anyway, no, I mean, losing a mama, if you have a good mama. I have some friends whose mamas are not so great, so I just wish that I pray someday they're going to get to have my, that I'll share my mama with them in heaven. That's what I'm excited about, because she was a doll. She was a doll. Anyway, okay. I was talking about moms to my son, and because he was sharing a little bit about what he felt like when I had my brain bleed. And I, he didn't even grasp the idea that there are moms who aren't good and aren't that great. And I mean, he, he knows about it, but he was just like, hmm. And I was like, man, that is, how blessed is he? Okay, I'm gonna steal some of this because I need something on here. We're just gonna take this. Here, I was making something with this. And I'm going to just wad this up. Yes. Yes. Um, so, but it's a little too bright. So, once again, I'm going to go in here with my vintage photo. You could even do this with water if you want to add water to it. Let me just show you what you can do with water and the oxides. And I didn't know what I was doing with this. And then I had a couple of friends, Tammy and Carmen, who were like, you should ask, what you should add water. And I was like, what? And then it makes it totally different. So then, and then we're gonna dry it. Something, water just does something cool to paper. And then you dry it. And it's gonna give us, it just makes, it takes off that new blue. It's not exactly the same, but it's, it's better, it helps. And it dries fast, this tissue. I just want it to go behind the, um, there we go, the picture, the little, the, pic, the dog, picture of the dog. It kind of makes it look kind of teal, which, uh, you know, that's my favorite color. And I also used some pinking shears on it. Look. Oh, catch the paper. Did you all know you're going to have to watch an idiot, a, a goober girl? I'm not. i got to stop saying that because people get so mad at me. Um, so I was just thinking we could put that on there like that. And then, and it just gives it a little bit of a zhuzh. A zhuzh, just a little zhuzh. We don't need all that. So let's just put a little glue 
on this tissue. And I just was working on making something to hang. Um, and I also have my hot glue gun, but I don't have like a real pointy thing to it. I think Shinuki Art does that a lot. And it just gives us a little layer. I love layering on here, so. Okay. There we go. Look how cute. And then I could totally go in here with this if I wanted to make it more vintage, which I always want to do. You do not have to do that. You could totally round the corners. You might need to glue that some, squish it in. Maybe, maybe. I was talking to somebody yesterday about my mom and because she'd be almost 94. My dad turned 99 last week, would have been 99. Thank God, he's in heaven. Anyway, so you could just, so I'm gonna choose, like, isn't that spectacular? I just think that's fabulous. I'm gonna go through and just pull the ones that have blue in there, just because that's kind of the theme we've got going on. Not that we don't love these, because they're cute. Look, that's, that's almost like a heart. That would be cute for Valentine's. I'm just gonna go in and I'm just going to, um, Straighten them up, give them just a little roughing up, not, not as much as like on the cover, but just a little. And then we're gonna add them in, trim them up, just do a little, and we can tuck them in. And then talk about, so you can, guys, you can do this with anything. Anything, anything. So that's what I would do. I'd go ahead and rough them up, and then I would go ahead and I would just take the white edge off. This, you could, these would be cute just as they are and just do a couple, you know, I wouldn't just do all dogs, but I've got them right here, so you just think about it, okay? You could do, you can do your, you could do your peppers. However, isn't that cute? They're so cute. How do you choose which one to have out? So cute, I love that little Pomeranian, isn't that cute? And then in the back, and then up here, you could do, you know, you can do, you could do one here and one here. You could always add a pocket up here. Oh, you know what she did? Just remembered. Oh my goodness. Do I have that? She put a little thing for a notepad up there. Two seconds. Two blooming seconds. I completely forgot that. Oh my gosh, she had some paper on here. She did the cutest little, um, She made a really cute little notepad just to go at the top. So, one, two, three. Woo! Crazy Beth. I'm just going to fold this over like that. And then we're going to tear it. Crazy, crazy girl. I forgot about that. I didn't watch to the end, but I'm like, what did we put there? And then I remember, oh, I know what she did. She made a little thing for notes. So, is that gonna fit there? It's a little big. Let's take this and we're gonna tear it down just a little bit more. Just a little bit, hopefully that's straight. Kind of, sort of, maybe. And there we go. And we want it to be like, we want it to fit. So let's just fold it like that. Okay. 
And then we're going to pair that right there. And then she just went in and she put like a little fold at the top. You don't have to do this. You can just fold it over like this. And then it is Tina. Yes. This is, she just, she, she sewed hers. As you all know, I don't like to sew. But then, and then she did a really cute little thing across the top. You know what I forgot to do, which we'll go do right now. She did, um, she just put like a little trim to cover it. So I'm trying to think, what do I have that I could make something cute out of it that we could cover it with? That I have close, that's right here near me. I'm just gonna take some more of this little tissue paper. And all I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna make it brown, I could. I'm just going to treat this like it's sorry silk, but for, make it sorry silk, but it's not how I sometimes do it. Just to cover up, just give a little zhuzh on the top and just pinch it up like that, just to give it a little, just a little something across the top. I don't know, like that. And then we can cut it. We could go in and put a little bit of brown on there. We could take one of these cute little pups right here and just kind of maybe glue him right there. How cute is that? Just for a little note thing. I'm just guessing. And then it goes like right there. Is that going to close good enough? Maybe. And then she just glued it in like that. How cute is that? So, completely forgot about my little fun stuff over here. Okay. So, if I wanted to put a cute little um, floral thing right there, how fun would that be? I'm just going to chop this right here so it kind of fits right there. And I think it might be upside down, but I'm not going to worry about it. Let's just do that. And then you got a cute, like, floral there. And I kind of got off, but that's okay. This is just going to give me ideas in my idea book. So, I will take the puppies out because I will use them on something else. But, you can just take, if you have any little, like, leftovers from your, your, um, if you have not tried them, this is a good time to get some transfers, guys, because they're on sale and they're super cute and they're super easy to use. Is this the lemon? Look how cute that is. Okay, so boom. And then if we wanted something little right there, what do I have? Just some kind of little, just something green or I don't know what I have in here. I have all kinds of just, that's Christmas. Uh, here's a little piece of lavender that might be fun. I'm going to, yep, I'm just gonna take this one. So, you know, you can, even if you don't know what to do with them all, you can go in. We can put a little piece of lavender right there, just to go around that edge right there. And it, you can just add that in and it gives you a little, I don't know, people. It just, it just finishes off. And how easy is this? And this was just lavender that I, I used some and I still have. And, Okay, so I pulled it off, just lay it back down, and it'll stick back, or it won't. Let's see if I can make this stick. Maybe I messed it up already. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but if it's not there, it's okay. There we go. And did I put that the wrong place? So, I can just scratch that off. It's kind of in the wrong place. And then you can just kind of go right over top of it and make it blend in if you want to, you know? Look how cute! So there we go. It's two pockets. And you could jam these up with all kinds of like ephemera stuff, you know? Little 
few hickeys. Makes you know you can pile them up. There's that one. You could you don't have to do these. You could do rectangles. Yes, Pat, you do. Look, and then there's that pocket, and then you've got your little note card. Wouldn't this be cute to stick down in a journal? Or this would be a great gift just as is and put it in an envelope and give it as a present. And you can make an envelope to fit it because we can make our own envelopes because we've covered that already. Haven't we? I think we have. I think we have. Let me show you real fast. Let's say we want an envelope that fits this, right? So we want it to come in like this. Let's just see if I can make one like this. Okay, and then we want it to go up to here, like that, and this will flow down like that, right? Am I doing this correct? I don't know. All right, so then we just, remember you just want to cut this like that, cut this like so, I may trim that back a bit. Yep, okay, I didn't fold that down, did I? Look, I'm sitting here questioning myself. Duh. Guys, I'm doing this super fast, but I have this on a much slower version on a video. I'll try to go back and find it and link it. You can find how to make um, and then I'm just going to trim this because we don't need all that. I'm just showing you if you don't have an envelope to fit stuff, you can make one. So you can close that up like that. This is a very hurried one, so just please remember that. Just an idea. Last minute idea. But if you can't find one, and then you could. And then this slides. Now use something that matches, okay? But look. Oh! Boom. Look at that. And then you pull it out. You could stick a gift card in there. If they're not into journaling, you can make each one as a different gift card. Kroger. Um, Amazon. Target gas and this could be list making yep isn't that cute i know this would be so cute for a valentine one except i would prop i would go in and cut all around that see how it's kind of vintagey on the edges i would totally do that okay i'm gonna go solo guys thanks for joining me sorry i was a little cray cray what's new what's new so here's the reminders um 25 off um iod stuff Till Friday, so you got two Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, four days. And then um, my Maker Studio starts today, drop in. Now, if somebody comes in, I can sweep it away, but I, I haven't had anybody interested. That's a local thing, so I'm sorry. It's not, I can't do it other ways, but um, also I am, we are talking about an event, and um, Cheryl, I've got a better one too. That was too quick, I apologize. But I was just trying to show you how you can make a really fun gift. And I took a long time. Once you get it down, you could make a bunch of them and then um, decorate them per person or whatever. You know, you could make, you can make a stack for, you know, friends, kids, you could do anything, which is so cute. And that's a great way to tuck in um, if people like paper. And then just make yourself a cute little envelope. And then you just go in and age it with some inks. Totally, totally cute. Let's look at this real quick. Let's see if our thing has dried. Let me show you real fast. So that looks, so that's the difference. You could take that on. Where's the one that's not, we didn't. I can't find it. This is the two colors we did. I kind of like it antique. But you know, you could also put like blue or pink or you know, um, the, the wax from our um, shipwrecked wax, if you've ever used that. 
You could just use the DIY paint and put on there. So much you can do. So, yep. I just thought she was fun, and I was watching her this morning when I couldn't sleep because I just don't ever sleep. I don't know what that's about right now, but I just can't sleep. I just can't relax. I just have a lot going on, friends. Anyway, thanks. I will be back tomorrow at 10 o'clock as well, so I hope you'll join me. We are doing 20 days of lives, not in a row, because I totally boondoggled it last week, and I had to, my iPad was a hot mess, so I apologize for that, and then I was just lazy over the weekend. Let's be honest, I was lazy, and I'm, I'm gonna embrace the laziness and just accept it as who I am right now when I get the chance to be lazy, and there you go. So I will see you all in the morning at 10 a.m. for another project. One last look at this cute little drawing that I'm gonna put on a wreath. Isn't that fun? Five dollars, y'all, five dollars and 30 cents. That's with tax. And a little bit of paint and a little bit of hot glue. And on the back, look how ugly it is. Do people show the backs? They just show you the fronts, but that's the reality here. That's the reality. Nancy, it's my pleasure. I'm glad to help anybody because you know, I'm just a hot mess over here. What do I know? I just get in here and there we go. Isn't it cute? I just think they're so cute. And I have a bunch more of my critters to use. It came with glitter and all kinds of stuff, so you can change that. Just because it tells you what to do at Dollar Tree, you don't have to do what they tell you you have to do. You know what I'm saying? This weekend is Galentine's on Sunday. If you're anywhere close by, it's 11 to 5 Sunday in shop. We are gooey. We've got a really cute giveaway freebie to anybody that comes in as long as they last. Cause you know, uh, scarves are all the rage onto purses, and we've got some really cute ones that are Valentine-y. They don't, they don't look Valentine, but they're the perfect color that you can use throughout the season. They'd be great for like Fourth of July. So, I love to do pinks and reds, and so we're kind of doing like the theme of the shop. And we're gonna, we've, I've got three people who are going to be in here for our um, pop up, the Celebration Company. They're making a really cute little um, family, Valentine family. We have this other lady, and I know her name, and my brain just stopped. She makes, she she draws portraits. She can draw a portrait of your animal. Little one for 15 bucks. It's gonna be so cute. Like, I guess you bring a picture in. Or you, I'm not sure what she does, but it's super cute. And then, um, my friend, the Cheerful Baker, will be here with her cookies and decorating cookies and stuff. So, that should be fun. I think, I have not confirmed that with her. Something may have come up, but I'm planning on that. And then I will be here just buzzing around, having fun, keeping the party going. So, Lots of new stuff coming. Please make sure to come in and um, if you're local and come see me and say hello. All right, I'm gonna open my shop now. All right, y'all be blessed. Let's go be part of the solution, not the problem. If we all love people well, what a difference this world would be, you know? So let's just be part of the solution. Let's not be a part of the problem. Be Jesus. Love God and love others. Let's go. Thank you, Deborah. I'm just a hot mess over here, but anyway. Okay, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Yay, bye.